Alright guys, so we're quickly looking at the next type of drug. And this is what is known as what? The niflumic acid. Niflumic acid. Niflumic acid. Now for the niflumic acid, you can see this is a uh, this is the biochemical structure. Alright, this is the biochemical structure. This is how the drug looks like. For the niflumic acid, you said I say non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug. So it actually belongs to the what? Phenamate group. Okay? So mechanism of action, it actually works by inhibiting the cyclooxygenase enzymes. That's what? The cyclooxygenase enzyme 1 and the cyclooxygenase enzyme 2. These enzymes are the ones that are crucial in the biosynthesis of prostaglandins. Alright? So they are actually lipid compounds that play significant roles in what? Inflammation, pain, and fever. So by inhibiting the cyclooxygenase enzymes, niflumic acid will actually reduce the production of what? Prostaglandins. Thereby, this will now alleviate the symptoms associated with what? Inflammatory, uh, inflammatory conditions. Okay? So indications now is used in treating various disease conditions like what? Rheumatoid arthritis, osteoarthritis, just to alleviate joint pain and inflammation. Post-operative inflammatory conditions, then muscular pain, right? This is to treat all of that. Pharmacokinetics is what? Absorption is rapidly absorbed after oral administration. Distribution is throughout the body. Metabolism is metabolized in the liver. Excretion is what excreted primarily in urine, okay? Side effects when taking this drug, nausea, vomiting, abdominal pain, dizziness. <coughs> Rarely will lead to gastrointestinal bleeding, but sometimes it can occur, like kidney damage or allergic reactions. Then contraindications. There are situations where you shouldn't use this drug. If there's hypersensitivity to what? The drug itself or any component of the drug. All right? If the person has gastrointestinal ulcers, it should be used with caution. If you have severe renal impairment, all right, you shouldn't even use it because you know, most of the drugs are kind of like excreted through the urine, okay? So if the urine is not going up, it's not cause what is known as what? A backlog of the body, of drug in the body, and this can actually cause toxicity. So this is it for knife, acid. See you guys.